Yeah, I'm not really sure why people keep forgetting that movie, to be perfectly honest with you. I mean, it's uh, Sean Connery playing a dragon. You know, Luke, Luke Rage. Yeah, I mean, it was, wasn't that bad of a film. Hey, everybody. Ox Bigley here. Um, am I a month late? Yes and no. I did get a, a, a loot crate last month. I just was not entirely impressed with it. So I kind of sat on the, the video footage. I do have it and I will upload it as soon as possible. Um, work and other stuff kind of got in the way as well. But this is April's crate, which is theme of dragons. Um, so yeah, maybe I'm, I'm sort of lackluster and in, in, in thinking. Now, obviously, the big thing is uh, the one TV show I cannot watch, nor probably would I because of all the uh, completely unnecessary nudities, but, and that show is Game of Thrones, which is, of course, something to do with dragons, which, you know, Blue Crate is now becoming a, a you know, just, here, advertise this, advertise that, you know, kind of a thing. Granted, they're not getting paid for it, but... They might as well be. Like with last month's crate, um, it was basically themed completely and entirely of, um, a t uh, it was a Titanfall, so. Anyways, brand new crate, open up. Give you a sneak peek of some of the stuff in there before I even look at it. And of course we have the dragon, uh, which is the theme. And I will say this, the, uh, the throne made entirely out of loot crates. Uh, that's, that's actually kind of cool. On the front, we just had the dragon sitting on it. So, this is of course the instruction manual, as I say every month. Uh, so I will not be looking at that because they're spoilers, big time. Let's see what we have in here. First things first, we have a insert number here sided uh, squishy foam die. Um, this might be a D D twenty, but there's a it might be a D twenty. Oh, mine's got a little scuff mark, but that's fine. It's still it's a squishy, you know, when you get aggroed at your uh, DM. You're welcome, Dan. Let me see what else I have here. <laughs> um, hmm. I have... Oh, this is Elder Scrolls. This is an Elder Scrolls little minifig, which looks like someone tried to tear into it. They, they didn't read my, my tweets. Luke Crate, you try to damage my stuff on purpose, you bums. Yeah, this is, and it says a Loot Crate exclusive, so they actually have a little bit of clout there for, you know, going on. Um, Ebon Heart Pact. Apparently packed by Ebon Hearts, I don't know. Um, and this is the Nord, which is actually the character I started playing as in El regular Elder Scrolls. I do not have online. It's by Symbiotes. Because my computer's crap, so there's, there's that reason. So... Crack this open, and it is packaged like so many snack, you know, food snacks. I'm not sure if I'm going to put this on my shelf or eat it. Um, do I have? Uh, I usually have like a little seam ripper to open these things up, but I have nail clippers. That'll work just as fine. There we go. A little tear on the side, and there it is. The helmet is coming up. I get that on there. Okay, there's a Nord. Got a cute little Nord. Actually, sort of uh, resembles the little, you know, money bunnies a little bit. Which maybe they can fight later. I don't know. But <clears throat> that is really cool. It's got the Nord armor, and the helmet does come off, revealing that he is indeed bearded and blonde. What's kind of cool is you can reposition his helmet and make him make him look like he's got different, uh, you know, facial poses, which is kind of cool. And it does have weapons. Uh, they were stuck in the bottom of the mag. I have, uh, I'm assuming, a Nord um, battle axe. It's been a while since I played uh, Skyrim. Leave me alone. And a Nord sword. Let's see if the if the Nordic warrior can hold his actual weapons. Dual wield, of course. So, because i got to get those stats up for dual wielding. And there you go, yeah. So, you know, that might, uh, if I had room up here, I, it would definitely be sitting there right now. But for right now, he's going to sit right here. Because he's cool. 
Alright, look great, you know what? Um, I apologize for everything I said last month. You'll, you'll, you'll see. <laughs> um, Game of Thrones, little mini fig. Now, I will say this, there is one character on here I want. I don't know any, I know saw it all about Game of Thrones, but there is one character on here I want, and it is the White Walker. Why? <clears throat> Take a look at that. The first thing I thought of when I saw this was actually a Funko uh, a vinyl figure that I saw of the White Walker. The first thing that popped in my mind, no, the first thing that popped in my mind was not anything from Game of Thrones because I've never watched it, but the guy named Orca from Legend of Zelda: Wind Waker who trains you. So I apologize if you hear any. Uh, lumber sounds in the background. I, I happen to share a room, so. But, <clears throat> let's correct, Age of 17 Plus. Well, is it the TV show or the toy? <laughs> Imagine it's maybe both. Ooh, and it comes in a black bag. Like a trash bag. <laughs> Man, we'll just give it to him. <laughs> So do I get my Legend of Zelda figure, or do I get something else? Let's tear open the bag of... Oh, do I get something else? Who do I get? I get not Obi-Wan Kenobi from not Lord of the Rings. <laughs> See who this is. It didn't even give me names on the bag. Um, apparently this is 2 of 24, so it's semi-rare. Um, I want the White Walker. <laughs> I want Orca from Legend of Zelda, and his head, his head is sort of articulated, but it's kind of hindered by his coat. I mean, it's not, it's not bad looking, it's kind of cool. I, mean, I don't know who he is, but, you know, it's still kind of cool. Very, very neatly articulated, I mean, uh, detailed. There's actually detailing of his uh, tunic underneath his coat, which is hidden by his hands and stuff like that, and the top of his head is squishy for some reason. I don't, I don't know why. It's just a, he's a newborn, maybe. Um... <laughs> That was both sick and wrong. <laughs> and of course we have uh, this month's Loot Crate pin, which is actually a really cool image. And this should have been the um, the picture for the uh, the instruction manual. That That's actually really cool looking. So this will go up on the wall. An actual D20, or D15. Maybe, no, this is D20, because it goes higher than that, I'm sure. Yeah, D20, there you go, D20. Um, I don't play tabletop games. I tried a few times. Um, I just can't get my head wrapped around it. It's just it's too 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 involved. Ooh, hello. We have a dog tag with a chain in a bag. And as soon as I get the bleeding bag open, I'll show you what it says on it. Oh man, it wasn't connected. <laughs> Let's drop the chain. This is Dragon Slayer. That's actually kind of cool. So, I just, uh. Okay, that's not working the way I want it to. <laughs> I actually had one of these made up. Um, that Walmart has a machine, so. That you can make your own, uh. That would not. That's about where it would hang at. Which is uh, too, a little too, a little too, too small for me. But I can then get an extra chain, long chain, long chain. <coughs> Sorry. Um, Dragon Shield Screen Cleaner. Oh, this is for your uh, your eye device. Um, I'm assuming it's a little. Uh, it's actually kind of cool. I like I like the way it looks. I might actually just turn this entire. Th you know, thing with the card included into a uh, <clears throat> into a magnet and stick it up on the wall because that's how cool it looks. Um, I might just use it to clean my computer screen. <clears throat> if I get this thing open, if I can get it out of the open package, there we go. Um, it's kind of kind of clothy feeling, like it's uh, you know, and of course it peels off of here. Oh, it peels off, and you're supposed to put the peeled, the sticky side on your finger and wipe the screen clean. Okay. 
And it's apparently washable and reusable and restickable. So that's um, that's cool. I, I, I like that crest. A lot better than Colgate. Um, <laughs> let's see what else is in the world is this? Dragon. <laughs> oh, they know me better than in. It's dragon jerky. And, and, and it's, it's like jerky strips with green flavor coloring on it. Fusro yum. <laughs> it's so stupid. Okay, you know what, Luke Crate? I apologize for last week, last month rather. Um, this is actually really good. Let's see what it says here. Manufactured for Luke Crate Incorporated. Um, <clears throat> ingredients, beef, sugar, water, soy sauce, uh, apple cider vinegar, salt, flavorings, uh, paprika, man, the lighting in here is terrible. Um, yeah, so let's give some dragon jerky a taste here. I'm not going to open it up with that. Because I intend to put this in my face. <laughs> and I don't want any nasty foot thingies to be, it smells like beef jerky. So, here's some of your green, uh, green bespeckled uh, beef jerky. A little sweet. Almost like a teriyaki. Mikey's Dragon Jerky. That, that, you know what? That label, that label should be on a t-shirt. Loot Grape. Speaking of t-shirts, again, no t-shirt. This should have been on a t-shirt. Either this or the or the uh, the the crest. Not Colgate. Um, that should have been on a t-shirt. Oh my goodness. So at the end of the day, let's do do a little recap of what I got here. I have the uh, oh yes, and I was gonna look through the book because I always do that secondarily after I look at everything. Game of Thrones quote because I have never seen the show, so it doesn't mean a dang thing to me. Um, <clears throat> so let's see what we got here. We got a whole thing about dragons and mythical beasts of legend and lore. A uh, picture of um, the Dovahkiin, which I do not remember him being ever called that in the game, but I could be mistaken. Okay, yeah, a picture of a you know. Hot nerdy gamer chick there. That's you know, <clears throat> which I'm sure is totally wearing those glasses because she's got poor eyesight. <clears throat> anyway, <clears throat> uh, what the heck is this? Think you know your Game of Thrones? Oh, it's like a it match the house to their names. I I couldn't care any less than I do now, <laughs> which is at zero. So yeah, I'm like. Can't care less. Elder Scrolls Online because my computer sucks. I can't play that. The Mega Crate of which I did not win again. So this is uh, what, the fifth month in a row or something like that. I've not won the Mega Crate. So let's see, see if we can keep that streak going for an entire year. Um, this month's items we have. I think everybody gets the Nord because there's no pictures of anything else. So hey, that's that's not bad. It would be cool if there was like little other you know weapons and. Uh, armor you can get for actually that would be a really cool idea to get like a base figure of your you know whatever race from Skyrim and just like sell weapons and <laughs> armor packs which would probably be retardedly expensive um <clears throat> Game of Thrones minifigure which what did I do with it uh, my little my little elven Obi-Wan <clears throat> and the, the dragon jerky which labels put on sideways there which Probably would have looked better, but you know, whatever, it doesn't matter. Still pretty good. And that bag is way more full than what I got. <laughs> uh, let me see. Dragon screen cleaner, which is, of course, what I got. Um, 20 sided stress dice. Okay. Um, 20 sided polyhedral dice. Okay, and the Dragon Slayer tag, and that was it. So, um, 
just to recap, you know, like I said, beef jerky, which is really good. I like I like the beef the beef jerky. I got the uh, the blue crepe pin, which will be going up on the thing. By the way, this is this was uh, from last month. This was a magnet I got from last month. It was a mashup of um, Titan and uh, Attack on Titan and Titanfall. So Attack on Titanfall. There you go. It was an amalgamated uh, you know thing for you. <clears throat> you got that. You got the screen cleaner. Got the the. The dog tag, which may actually be hanging from my rearview mirror uh, in my car, <clears throat> along with the Sonic uh, air freshener I got. Why did I do this for air freshener? <laughs> Should be doing it. Um, a couple of uh, crates ago, I got the screen cleaner, which I think this entire thing, as is with the card backing, is going to become a magnet, and I'm going to have to buy another one of these magnetic boards. Um, <clears throat> I got my two 20-sided eyes. So I can roll, a, you know, a D40 or something there. Um, and I got the, uh, the, the, the Game of Thrones uh, Elvish Obi Wan and the uh, <laughs> the uh, the Dova King. So this is kind of cool. I just wish I could turn this uh, little horns around. The horn should not be pointing down. I don't know. It's wearing horns or something. Anyway. That was my loot crate uh, and yours. Uh, I'm sure yours will differ if you got one this month for April 2014. Hopefully, I will be able to get this video up uh, soon. Um, it is now the 19th. I'll probably get it done and posted on the 20th because my computer, again, is crap and does not wish for me to lo uh, render any videos in, a, in one 24 hour period. So, uh, I'll probably go to work and come back and it'll be done. So, <clears throat> with that said, folks, if you enjoyed this video, do everything you need to do to let me know you liked it, which is comment, favorite, and subscribe, and share this video to friends and family, or maybe your pet, Marmoset. Um, <clears throat> also, if you want to get in on the Loot Crate action, there is a link downstairs in the description of this video to Loot Crate. Sign up. It's cheap, easy to do, and fun. So... Other than last month. Video coming soon. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you next month for more Loot Crate. Find more great videos and blogs at ManicExpression.com. <laughs>